Yay, we live? Oh yeah. Oh, great, Caleb. How are you doing? It's Adrian, you're from, um, from Cardiff in South Wales, in the UK. And um, as you know, guys, all, all my followers and Facebook friends, I'm with some lovely people here in Spain, out on my um, cryptocurrency event. I've been here for two or three days now. I'm up, out here for seven days, actually. So I've um, got three nights left. But uh, this guy on the left here with the, um, with the baseball cap on, um, I only met him yesterday. And I was quite blown away. He spoke for around, well, I think it was at least two hours. And um, I just really wish I recorded what he talked about yesterday. But uh, I only met this guy. He's from Germany. His name is uh, Aragon or Frank. Is it Frank the Bank? Frank the Bank. Yeah. Frank the Bank. So um, anyway, just introduce my partner. There's Virginia. She's sitting opposite me. Hey, Virginia. <laughs> nice to see Hello. you. <laughs> She's just listening in. Right. And obviously we've got um, Aragon's wife, Sarah, Hi. on the end. Hi, Sarah. And um, a good friend of mine I met Jesus in the last Christ couple of days. Jesus Christ, this is the really. Simon, <laughs> Simon, yeah. Where are you from, Simon? Austria. Austria, yeah, okay. Oh, she's from there. Sarah, are you from Germany? I'm from Germany. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's great. Where are you from, Khaled? I know you're not on camera, but there you go. I'm from Vermont, the East Coast of the United States. Border is uh, New York and Massachusetts for all you international folks who... Yay! <laughs> Excellent stuff. So anyway, we just we just done this. We just doing this video on the spur of the moment. We got no, there's no real plan to this. We got no idea what we're going to talk about. We just, I'm not sure who's drunk the most. I'm okay at the moment. I haven't drunk that much. Have you drunk much? Yeah, a lot. But anyway, um, like I just want to uh, introduce this guy on the left here, myself, uh, Aragon or Frank the Bank, and uh, I was quite blown away what he spoke about with regards to. Well, he, he was just above above my knowledge to a certain degree with regards to cryptocurrency, uh, the, the money system, you know, the the, econo the world economy, you know, everything about it being, it being a, big, a big Ponzi scheme, you know, the, what, what people, what the governments are doing, the Federal Reserve is doing, doing without money. So at the end of the day, he went on for about how long? He didn't speak for yesterday. Went two hours, wasn't it? At least. At uh, three hours. So uh, oh, I just want to pass you on. To Frank, and um, so we can just gives you a bit of a breakdown what he's been up to and where he's from, and he's gonna just basically run this space. I'm just the introducer of this guy's okay. This is my Facebook, obviously page, but um, I'm just gonna pass this over to Frank, and um, mm -hmm. let's let, let's see what he's got to say about. We haven't planned anything, Frank, <laughs> are we? In general, we we haven't yeah. planned anything. No, I've and no you haven't had too much to drink, have you? Are you okay? No, I, we have drank a lot, a lot, uh, a lot. <laughs> okay. because I I have a big uh, connection to Wales people. We, we wow. drink a lot. Wales people drink a lot too. <laughs> okay, any, any feedback coming in? Any, any people coming on the call? Oh yeah, we have some uh, Muhammad Azim, we have Tony Palmer, Dennis Appleton, just to name a few names here. Okay, right just keep rolling. As anyone new comes on to the um, to the live call, just shout out their names, keep them connected in the call, you know, make them feel welcome. Very anyway, Frank, it's over to you, my friend. What, what, what have you got to say with all this? Uh, wow, why, why are you here? Why are you in Spain? Why are you doing Spain? Probably from Germany. In Spain, I'm only because the company has uh, invited uh, me. My English, I must say before, my English is not perfect. I'm not a perfect English speaker. I have only to learn to drink, not to speak English. Yeah, uh, and uh, so I can say at the first. A makes me crazy because his name is Adrian. Yes. And I've said at the first day. Adrian remember me something at the film Rocky, uh, Rocky one. To my Adrian, I love I love his name because Rocky one Adrian. Yes, right. Adrian, I love it. Adrian, are you, you are, have this kind uh, of name. I remember in this film and I like it. So right. emotional. Mm. But no, uh, we begin to be serious. I can't be, but I try. Um, just do a quick sound check, um, Kyle. Just put a quick sound check. Can everyone hear us? Okay. Just um, if somebody can put, if somebody can put in the chat that uh, everybody can hear the sound. Okay. There's no background noise. Just to make sure we're not talking to ourselves. If somebody can put in the chat that um, everyone can hear. Well, Frank more than me, obviously. I've got a bit of um, a private microphone going on here, so um, we have more viewers coming on anyway. Wow, so there are so much Torino. views. I tried to call my friends the Backstreet Boys, but I have uh, <laughs> any connection to them. <laughs> <laughs> Backstreet Boys. They're a, they're, they're a group, aren't they? They're a, mu a music group. What are the Westlife doing? <laughs> you were talking about the blockchain like boys. Mohammed Azim says loud and clear. Tom Gallagher says hear you. Dennis Appleton says all okay. Hello. Hi, Dennis. Mina Granado says, 
Yo, Adrian! Yeah. Adrian! <laughs> uh, yes, uh, Adrian! And i got to be honest with you, Rocky 1 was probably one of the first films I watched, and I was prob- I, I really enjoyed that. That was, yeah, it was a legend film, wasn't it? Legend. Yeah, definitely. Um, Sylvester Stallone, yes, there you go. Yes. Well, anyway, Frank, this is over to you. you now, you've, got to, you've got to impress my followers, my friend. I'm going to be adding you as a friend shortly, so, um, I, you know, I'm, I'm trusting you as, as a friend. I only met you yesterday, don't forget. So I have no idea where you are. Yes, of course. And you speak so fast that I yeah, don't understand yeah, sorry, anything. Yeah. But I try to speak now. Don't forget, because I'm from Wales and Frank is from Germany. So we've got a bit of um, a language situation. I speak very fast. and Very, Frank because speaks very I'm not slow. a mother yeah. speaker in English. I cannot speak German because I come from Germany, but I haven't learned any grammar. I come only uh, from the middle school. But what I can, I can show you a big pic about the finance system and mm. cryptocurrency. This is only what I have learned. Yeah. Yeah, Frank, basically, I see Frank as an expert in cryptocurrency and basically the money system. You know, I got loads of followers on Facebook and I'm being, like, you all know me guys on Facebook. I'm a property expert, right? I'm no expert in cryptocurrency. I'm an expert in property in the UK, okay? So uh, I don't claim to be an expert in cryptocurrency yet. But probably hanging around with this guy for a bit longer, I, I probably will be at some point. But um, at the end of the day, I'm on the way, yeah, cheers, Caleb. But at the end of the day, property is my expertise. This is why I'm doing a video with my friend here. He's the expert in the financial system, the money system, um, the cryptocurrency space. Is is, is this one big money sort of Ponzi scheme? Is that right, what I heard yesterday? No, when you make like this with uh, your telephone, it's like CIA and FBI. They make it with a light in my eyes and say, what do you do? And I don't see anything, and I go down. No, so... uh, I will tell you, yeah. we are in the area of cryptocurrency. Yeah. Cryptocurrency is for the most people um, not, uh, s- yeah, this is not so uh, f- famous, they don't know uh, something about it. Uh, some people have heard about this, the most people have heard anything about cryptocurrency. Cryptocurrency is like uh, 15 years before, like PayPal. Nobody knows PayPal. They said, no, I don't want to use PayPal. People. Uh, PayPal use my data, PayPal uh, want to have my credit card mm. data, they want to have my name. I don't want to give my data to pay- PayPal. PayPal, yeah. PayPal, yes. yeah. After 15 years now, more than 15 years, the people, they use PayPal, it is completely normally. It's the same was uh, 40 years before with the credit card. The people come and say, oh, this is plastic. What is that? This is no money. I don't want to use a credit card. Um, at this point, the most people in the USA use credit card. In uh, uh, Britain, a lot of people use uh, credit card. Mm. In Germany, not so much. This is funny. Uh, I think 6% of the people in uh, Germany use a credit card. But uh, what I want to say is the most people, they don't want to use a credit card. They use a credit card because it's easy to pay. It's not cheap to pay. Mm. The fees, yeah, the fees. The fees for the merchants are really big. The merchants hate the credit card. But for the people, it's easy. They make ping, pong, pay. Pay for it. Ping, pong, pay. So for the merchant, it's not so funny because they must pay a lot of fees for this. And mm. uh, when you go to your bank and you want to transfer money, to a country like China, Singapore, uh, USA, uh, United States, uh, uh, United Emirates, you must uh, have time. Two days, three days, four days, and they take a lot of fees for mm. this. When you have a cryptocurrency, digital money, real digital money listed on an exchange, you have a real blockchain listed in the blockchain register transparent you have a real serious like bitcoin or mm. litecoin or ripple you have a real cryptocurrency like capricorn capricorn yeah yes so then you have the possibility to send money in 3 seconds all over the world no fees you get cash back from capricorn only from capricorn not from all cryptocurrency you get cash back you get a lot of benefits you have a loyalty program to uh, buy things very cheap so the merchants the clients they have a lot of motivation to use our system and uh, I say every day thank you 
for the CEO, for the CEF, for the founder of the company. I say, wow, you have founded a nice company because people want to have a currency that is uh, safe. They have no inflation. The people or the state cannot take your money away. You have six seconds to pay. You get cash back. This is like Alice in Wonderland. Mm. Alice in the Wonderland. You have all what you need. And you say, this cannot be. I don't know systems like this. Mm. No, we have this system. And we go end of this year. And the market and everybody can use this system. You can say, okay, save a lot of money. Mm. I protect it. I, I'm safe with my money. Uh, I have the possibility to send money without fees. I get cash back for it. This is amazing. Mm. And at the end, the elf effect is when you wait, it could be. It's no guarantee, but it could be like Bitcoin. There was no guarantee to mm. that you earn a lot of money because the currency grows up in the first years exponentially. So, uh, any, any, more, any more questions? Um, Carl, keep, if you can put some questions. Any yeah, questions, saying, guys? I just want to kind of like add to that. Yeah, also, put some questions in the chat. I also want to just mention Mohammed Azim says, totally agree with you, Frank. Yeah. Ann Campbell just joined. Hello, Ann Campbell. Great to have you here for this conversation with us and Frank the Bank. All right. But uh, it's like uh, another thing. We have like this huge leverage, this huge potential with, with cryptocurrency. It's it's in it's it's like a penny stock, all right. Yes. When you get involved with it at the right stage, it's venture capital, all right. And right now we're in the very early stage where you really need to get involved if you're looking at cryptocurrency or uh, wanting to take some action with it. You should talk to Adrian right away and get some information from him about it tomorrow after you finish watching this conversation. But you have the, the opportunity to multiply any amount of money you have. You don't have to have a lot of money. Okay, you could, you could buy half a Bitcoin for $300. Or you get just a Bitcoin's worth of Capricorn, okay? When it, and you're going to be able to get thousands of percents worth of, uh, um, well, I can't make any guarantee, okay? But basically the potential in markets where you have things that start at a low value is that you can get a multiplication of your money, okay? So... Okay, check the questions, Carl. Any more? Please, guys, put as many questions you can in the chat, all to do with cryptocurrency, the money system, you know, anything you want. Now's the time to put it in the chat, and let's get this over and done with, okay? Anyway, um, Frank, what regards to your experience? Are, are you, um, what's your background over the last, I don't know, 5, 10, 20 years? You're not, you're not very old. And, uh, yeah, you know, very old, yeah. You're, funny. you're not very old. I'm 46 but now, uh, oh. this year, month. Uh, a, a lot of people don't know that I'm uh, have the age of 46. I look like 20. Yeah. But, uh, okay, that was a joke. 26. 20, 26. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so uh, a lot of people uh, call me in the in the in the street and ask me, "Wow, you look like Leonardo DiCaprio." Uh, Lapi, Capri, yeah. Capri, Leonardo, Leonardo and DiCaprio. I am not. I'm not Leonardo DiCaprio. I am Leonardo the Capricorn because wow. we have the Capricorn and I am the Leonardo of this Capricorn. So Wolf of Wall Street is a very interesting film because in this film a lot of people wa get rich with penny stocks. Mm. So penny stocks is uh, the best business when there is serious penny stocks because you don't pay so much money and you have from nothing a big value, a big growth. And this is the same with the cryptocurrency. When the cryptocurrency has an age of four or five years, like a Bitcoin, mm. it's okay, but it can't grow so much. But when you have the cryptocurrency that will uh, uh, bring brought in the market, they, they will uh, establish it in the market, then you have at the first two, three or four years, the most exponentially uh, grows. And this makes you rich. It's like a serious penny stock. And a lot of people want only to buy currency or shares. They are very expensive. This is normally. 30% of the people have learned to buy things when they are expensive. Mm. When all people buy it, all people buy it. Now, that is not the right way. You must think like a professional. Buy it with the most potential. 
and then you pay no so much money and just the most possibility to earn a lot of money every professional trader every professional investor every professional in business make it in this way he don't comes at the end he comes at the startup or at the growth capital or early stage or he brings his money inside and say mm. okay I earn a lot of money and this is cryptocurrency cryptocurrency is a currency it's its only currency no inflation you can protect your money you have a lot of benefits but at the end you have the possibility not the guarantee mm. the possibility to earn a lot of money from the growth yeah and basically as I was saying guys I, I, I've got a property back and all my money is in property okay I made, I made a million pounds from property in the last boom okay and the market crashed in property I went to Spain to live for two years I took a two-year holiday and started looking for ways of, as a hobby to look uh, to make money online as you probably already know but I've only I've only come across cryptocurrency in the last sort of 12 months 18 months I wish to God somebody had rang me in 2009 and said buy some Bitcoin you know because people made millions from Bitcoin with a pizza didn't I am I right in 2009 2010 they made millions so um, what I'm doing I'm selling my properties I'm diversifying and I'm spreading it 33 percent I'm, I'm involved in cryptocurrency property and I've also been involved in gold and silver as well so but that's, a, that's another story but what's so special do you think about Capricorn Cause how many other coins are there this about 700 plus coins why is Capricorn so different from all the other 700 plus coins you know we're all here on a Capricorn event why are we here you know so it's just uh, complicated to ask me things like this because uh, uh, everybody who looks a uh, video or he wants to hear me he thinks okay he wants only to sell the Capricorn okay normally I'm a seller I'm a professional seller and I like to be a seller but we must speak about what I want to sell nothing or a great opportunity and when I speak about cryptocurrency we will uh, we have now 800 or 900 cryptocurrency mm. in the future we will have thousands of cryptocurrencies or hundred thousand that is not my uh, or opinion this is a reality but you must know before what is the market we have now 14 billions that is not very much 14 billions in cryptocurrency the leader, sh the leader of the cryptocurrency, uh, the leading cryptocurrency is Bitcoin, with uh, I think 11 billion, 11 billion. Mm. In the future, in only 10 years, cryptocurrency get 5% of the market, of the currency market, of the fiat money market. That means paper, mm. paper. US dollar forex. or uh, uh, yes forex mm. market of the euro uh, dollar the market is 1,900 trillion in the year really you have read right 1,900 trillion in the year this is unbelievable big market and we get only the cryptocurrency whole the whole cryptocurrency market the whole cryptocurrency area get only 5% of the market. That means we go up from 14 billions to 80 trillions in, air, in only 10 years. All cryptocurrency, not only Capricorn. So when you have a good marketing, when you have cashback like we, uh, us, we, have all, we are the only cryptocurrency with a cashback system. We have cashback for the clients, mm. cashback for the merchants. We have a complete mobile mobile payment system. We have made our job like a fintech and high tech company. Mm. This is normally a high tech must make his job. Then you can bring this in the market. This is normally like a Tesla car, like an Apple. Mm. And then you earn a lot of money when you only get one percent or half percent on 0.1 percent of this market because the market is amazing it is big and this is what i mean we can have in the future 20 cryptocurrencies like capricorn and we all earn a lot of money and we will get uh, up like uh, a company from billions or trillions because this is the biggest market ever in the world 
More about, yeah, I, I, I totally agree. Got it's a incredible. question here from yeah. somebody, okay? Great, keep the questions coming, guys. Yes, yes. Questions. Tom Gallagher asked, what is the opportunity? The, oppor the opportunity, the business opportunity is called Visionary, which focuses on Capricorn and Capricorn. You guys want to expand on that? Yeah, that's an yep. interesting question. I like questions like this because um, these are intelligent questions. So we have two different business. This is funny. We have the Capri Pay. This is a payment app, mobile banking. We have no fees. We have the payment system. We have the cashback system. This is like Wonderland. It's not a joke. You can prove. You can check it. But they don't need visionary. They don't need a network marketing. They exist. They exist different from us. And everybody say, okay, why we uh, don't need you as a network marketing? This is uh, an intelligent question mm. because we, as a network marketing company, Visionary, are the only company in the whole world who has the right to sell the mining time to produce this currency up to 70% uh, cheaper, less, mm. not so much money, cheaper. To up to 70%, you can save so much money. You can produce in our company this currency. What it means? You have your own money making machine. That means 500 or 400 years before, only rich people, only uh, people like uh, lords can make this business. And now we have the possibility, like a democratic business, democratic democracy, sorry for my English, that we can produce a currency and we earn money with the producing of the, com of the currency. This is called mining. Mm. You earn mm. from only producing, not from the value, from producing it. You can, mm. let, you can let work your money. And this is uh, unbelievable. We are in a new time. We are in the future now. The future is now. And this is web this is internet mm. 4.0. What about um, any more questions coming in? Caleb, we have another pay? question by uh, Mohammed Azim. Yeah. Will the public be able to buy CTC Capricorn with fiat currency quite easily from the Bits Pure Exchange? If so, what? when will we be able to do this or is it too early? I know I can already answer that mm. question. That's going to be uh, three to six months out. Uh, but Bit Pure, the exchange, is launching within a week, I believe. Yeah. Am I correct on that? Any other details yeah, on that? And the, and the fees on bit, bit peer is um, 0.15% compared to 0.25% on Bittrex, so it's a lot cheaper as well, the fees. Excellent. Yeah. But um, the other thing is, what I've gathered from Bit peer is it's a lot more um, secure because Bittrex hold all the money, don't they? Bittrex yeah, hold all the money? It's decentralized. Yeah. Bit peer is a decentralized exchange where you don't hold your altcoins and yeah. your bitcoin on the exchange is kept in your wallets that are outside the exchange yeah. so you're managing that yeah i've, I've got i've got thirty thousand copper coins in yes. actually in bitrex and i'm quite worried about that now you know so i'm going to be yeah, moving my my copper coins out of bitrex into a more secure place but anyway um what about um legislation um in regards to the legality of all this cryptocurrency there's all these different cryptocurrencies out there there's a lot of, I'm being, I'm being pitched on different cryptocurrencies every single day of the week for the last 18 months. Join this cryptocurrency, join this coin, join that coin. Yes. You know, there's lots of scams out there. Yes. What is the, for all the newbies out there, what's the best way? How do you check if a cryptocurrency, especially Capricorn, is, is a real deal and it's all above board and legal, you know? Well, I understand very good because I come not to this company as a leader because they give me extra money. When I would go with my uh, wisdom and with my technical support, to uh, scam currencies, they would pay me a lot of money to make the support because they have money, a lot of money, scam currencies, have a lot of money because they have no real value. And so they pay me a lot of money when I would make the support. And uh, my decision is that I don't want to work in a not ethical business. This is my personal uh, decision. And so I can say you something. Uh, go away, please. Um, uh, and uh, so I can uh, say you, uh, for me, it's important to make a good job for the uh, people, for the humans. For me, only business is interesting. 
that brings more value to the people. More value means you have a real currency, you have no fees, you have a listing. And now hear me, you have a listing on the exchange. When I say listing, I mean you can go on the exchange, bitbreaks.com, worldcoinindex.com, uh, uh, coinmarketcap.com, and you find the currency there. That means you have in US dollar or Euro a real currency. And um, the, the second is you have on blockchain the blockchain is a, a basic to have a real and serious cryptocurrency the most uh, cryptocurrency they are at the exchange they are not so famous nobody knows them the cryptocurrency they are uh, famous excuse me sir can you go out of the picture <laughs> the most uh, cryptocurrency they are famous they are not so uh, serious because they are in the network marketing mm. scene and they are only in the back office. So they have the value in the back office, but when you search them and the uh, exchange, you don't find any listing, mm. you don't find any blockchain. When you get, uh, go in uh, Shane's CryptoEat.info, you don't find the blockchain of the mm. currencies because they have no blockchain and um, the only the only what you see is in the back office a value and so what you must look is not that I say to you we are visionary we are the best Capricorn are the best now I don't say it I say check it for yourself look if your currency that you know in the network marketing have and the exchanges, worldwide exchanges, have their listing, when they have not a listing, they can make all the time blah, 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 blah. Mm. That is not the answer. You must have, a, you, must, you must see this, they have a listing. When they don't have a blockchain mm. transparent, then blah, 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 blah. Mm. They must see the blockchain. All other things are not serious. This is only like Wolf of Wall Street. Mm. They say things to sell his concept, but they have no serious currency. We have a serious currency. We have the payment app. Everybody can prove it. Everyone can check it. Everybody can make download from the uh, mobile app. Mm. We have already, and we go end of this year, like a real high-tech company, like a real fintech company, we go in the market and we have merchants, they want to use our payment system with this currency. Mm. What about this, um, that's, that's brilliant, uh, that's, that's incredible. Um, what about this uh, internal system? People talk about, they got their own internal blockchain that they can buy and sell their coins within this internal system. What's all that about? Um, is, it, is it some kind of in system closed coin. system? Yeah, what's all? Is that illegal or what? Or illegal? What, what's, I don't uh, know, a, what's a, a, a system? Uh, I, I must explain this because um, you must understand that we are uh, like competition for the system. You know, mm. when you have a, uh, when you have this money in your pocket, you think this money is money. You think this because it looks like money. You have never thought before that this is only paper. This is paper. So you have here, you have here a copyright. Yes, that's right. So most people don't know it. Here is a copyright sign. So this is not money. That is that you believe that it is money. Here is a copyright. Mm. Huh? A currency don't need a copyright. You are not an apple or a Coca-Cola. This is a currency, a paper currency, but this has a copyright. That means you believe that this is real money and you can't copy it this is the answer you can't go and copy it this is not real currency this is only paper nothing not gold behind not real estate behind there's nothing value behind you believe on it there's inflation they can change the currency 20 years later to a other, from Euro to US dollar, from US dollar to the Deutsche Mark, German Mark, they can make what they want and you lose money since 100 years. So a real cryptocurrency is limited. 
you have limited, I say, 20 million coins, 200 million coins. Nobody can change it. When you make it in the blockchain, the blockchain goes in the internet. You can never change the sum of the coins. This is like real democracy. This means all the users have the guarantee that nobody can come and say, I make 200 million from this more. I make one a billion from this more. And you lost a lot of money from inflation. No, cryptocurrency is the only way from democracy. Mm. This is the reason why people m learn to understand that we have the biggest, not revolution, evolution and money system ever. Frank, just, um, that was brilliant. Just, just explain the words we used, two big words we used yesterday. I mean, my friend John was in the front when you were speaking. Quantitative easing. Well, yes. explain, explain quantitative easing, uh, what that means in regards to the dollar, euro, the word, yes, two uh, words, uh, easing. It's just interesting. Uh, please say this uh, uh, again in the Qu camera. What is uh, quantum? Quantitative easing. Okay. Because my English is not enough, I'm uh, only um, a, a shy German, and so my English is not perfect. Excuse me. I learn every day. Uh, but uh, what he says is that uh, uh, central banks... What the fuck is a uh, central bank? I don't know it. Who has given a bank the right to make this? Have you given the bank the right? I am not. But he produced this money. Why is this bank? Why not this? Why not this person? Because they have get the right to press this money. Why? What is the state? Mm. What is the central bank? It could be that 500 years before, a uh, lord makes the money, and today it's the central bank. But where is the lord? Who is the lord? It could be that the lord is behind the central bank, and he makes this money to earn a lot of money, to press this money, mm. because the people believe on this. They have learned to believe on nothing. This is like monopoly. And so, mm. a lot of people understand now that we are no, uh, not in a democracy, we are in a bad system in every country, in Britain, in USA, in Germany. We have all the same system. We have paper money. Some people can press it. They can make more and more and more and more. And when the central banks make more money from this without value, what happened with your money in your pocket? Mm. It goes down, goes down yeah. and this is not inflation, you know, you have never heard about this. An investment bank or central bank, it, uh, is the name is M3. That means if you press more money, your money lose more value. And this is a unbelievable high inflation. Mm. You can't feel it, you can't see it, it's mm. just your enemy. So, so 50, if you had 50, uh, 50 euros, say 20 years ago, you, you could buy so, so much bread or food and petrol. Yes. And now, 20 years later, the 50 euros, you, you, it's less bread, isn't it? Yes. Less milk, less petrol, less fuel. You less. mustn't be a mathematic genie. You must only look uh, 30 years before. You look what can you buy for uh, 20, uh, I say not you, because uh, 40 years or 30, 30 years before was not a euro. That's the uh, secret, because they change the money systems very fast. Mm. Why? Because they don't want that you have a long-term possibility to understand that they are all a snowball system. All the money system is a snowball system. It's a scam. Some, they, yeah. they take money from you because they press a lot of money. And before you understand it, they make a new currency, then you take your money because the new currency you don't get without costs. You must mm. pay it with a lot of losing value. And then you get the new currency for the next 30, 40 or 50, year, mm. 50 years. And then they say, okay, our system hasn't worked. We make a new currency. Mm. And this works since hundreds of years. Yeah, any more questions, um, Khaled, coming in at all? Any, any questions? I see any other questions. Okay. What about, um, t explain about, yes, I, I thought it was quite um, intriguing. You mentioned about the Federal Reserve. Are they, are they some kind of mafia? Are they in control of all this? 
the Federal Reserve in America? Who are these? Who are these people? You said eight, eight different people. Is that right? Yeah, I, I don't want much? to speak too much about the Federal right, Reserve okay. System uh, because there are a lot of books. When you go on the internet mm. and you Google about the Federal Reserve System from uh, United States, then you find enough books, enough uh, mm. uh, press and anything that you explain that the owner of the Federal Reserve is not the United States. These are eight families, private families. Mm. Uh, the same owner of the investment banks like Goldman Sachs or J.P. Morgan or um, uh, Rothschild Capital or uh, Chase Manhattan. This is not, this is boring for me to speak about mm. this because a lot of people will say, oh no, I don't believe it. Please, make the research for mm. yourself. We have a private money system because the same persons, they have had the money system 500 years before and there was lords, there was kings. You say, no, I don't want to have a lord. I don't want to have a king. They press the money and I, I lose money. I have inflation. Then you see that they take your money away. Now we have the state. Mm. But the state doesn't exist. Behind them are the same people like 500 or 300 years before. They have the monopoly to press the money and they earn the money when you take the paper money in your pocket. Mm. They are the winners. And they press and press and press more money and they take giants. They take giants for paper. This is a debt system. It's a money debt system. This is the biggest scam ever. And we, yeah. we want, we are not the only company. We are only a part of a big evolution. They want to change the system. A lot of people in the, this uh, area are not capitalists. They are long hair, they smoke a lot of grass, they are nerds, they have good ideas, they want to change the system as they have ideas because they don't like it any longer to be in this system that steal money from the people. Because when you work and you have a hard job, you get money for this and next month your money has not the same value what is this? You have worked the same eight hours per day, mm. the same ten hours per day, but they, they make it that your, mm. that your income lose in the value. Every year, every month, that is not fair. We have not a fair system, and we must change it. Right. What about, um, just, we, we, we're going to bring this to an end very shortly. What's the guy who got killed, John F. Kennedy, American president? What, what was that all about? Was that something yeah, for the most people, this is so yeah, is, too, yeah, uh, yeah, but uh, too hard because uh, they uh, don't understand the uh, a real uh, spirit of cryptocurrency. They learn new about cryptocurrency. I don't want to say too much mm. today because uh, everybody can make research. When I say uh, all, the people say all that, hey, say it is the truth. It is right what he said. I don't believe it. No, look for yourself. Make a research. I'm not the uh, godfather. I'm not the papa. I'm not your daddy. Make the mm. job. Research. Yeah? Then we will see John F. Kennedy has want to change the system. He has uh, mm. signed up the Federal Reserve Act that the Federal Reserve was gone away. He has bring. He has brought the United States notes in the market. John F. Kennedy has changed for a few weeks the system. Only for a few weeks. Mm. Then they have killed him. He got killed and assassinated. Yeah. Because they don't like somebody who changed a multi trillion business. Wow, okay. Anyway, guys, Simon, are you the same? Are you, are, you quite, are you quite new to this business, are you? Are you quite new to this business? Visionary crypto. This is Jesus Christ. Let's, let's give Simon a bit of, um, Say like, yeah. where are you from anyway? I'm from Austria in Austria. Europe, so like southern of Germany, and I'm confronting myself with like blockchain technology and cryptocurrency like almost two years ago because one of my good friends and mentors, he was one of those guys who had the balls to actually finally take the tip years ago and he bought bitcoins for about 36 cents in the days back and 
that figured out to be like a really a good deal, you know. Mm. And yeah, since then I'm hooked to the thing. How, how much money he has earned with this? I don't want to tell. It's not yeah, important, yeah. you know. <laughs> it's like you grab a chance and you get it or you leave it. It doesn't matter. Tears about broken milk doesn't matter, like stuff mm. like that. That's why there's Capricorn. There's yeah. Chance. Capricorn is definitely one of those chances. There are coming definitely quite a lot of good, good opportunities uh, towards us in the next couple of years. I feel like the times right now is like comparable to the early days of internet, like 15 days, uh, 15 to 20 years ago, where like the big companies who are like the, the global players today, they have actually started founding there. And I was, I was just like, like, thanks for Frank the Bank. Mm. We had a like hard and busy days these days, but I say or something, this guy has some fundamental knowledge on the on the financial market. And for special details and understanding, it's important to connect with your leaders, with your friends, with your guys and make your own thoughts because those opportunities which come in along us now the next years, they are so, so fundamental. And I say like, it's really the perfect time to make just if you want to say like this a fortune out of it mm. but what I think is more important we don't have an alternative the alternative is to stay and remain in a system which is definitely gonna break down live with no value in your pocket even if you hard worked your whole life mm. and that's what was funny when you said yesterday with those euro, for example, with the copyright, I wouldn't be forced for for printing wrong money if mm. I would copy those. Yeah. But I would be forced for a act of copyright part, you know? And mm. that's a funny thing. So actually, I'm not a fan of being in conflict with something because I think like if you're going into open war with something, the energy is just like go away you can't get a solution if you're against something you have to establish new systems and for those people who are open-minded who look for opportunity who are not satisfied who are looking for more in their life and want to realize dreams or just get the personal freedom and just maybe safety for life for their family and spend time with them this is the blockchain era holding the most potential for them and all that is giving a possibility to make a good living out of it, but without taking it from somebody else. You know, it's like sharing is caring community, something yeah. like this. And get the knowledge, just get the impression that something new is coming towards you. And it's definitely worth getting some knowledge about this. So check the internet, check your leaders, check all your Skypes, your, mm. all your live shows. It's important knowledge and, and value what you deliver. So there are many experts out there choose for the value and decide for stopping the bullshit that's my message so okay, thanks for thank you very much Caleb, i'm gonna put the camera on you the i love you changed, okay you too bro. pass the camera over to you <laughs> yes yes <laughs> it's over to you adrian, Caleb, with, um... adrian! no I'm gonna, I'm gonna put Caleb on the spot no how long well, tell us a little bit about yourself and what you've been able to do, do the last 12 months uh, regards to visionary copper coin and what's your background you know well, my background is I started uh, network marketing and internet marketing and web development uh, back in 2011 and uh, kind of just found my way towards cryptocurrency, starting to look at cryptocurrencies around 2000 and uh, to, right at the end of 2014. I already, knew some, I already knew something that was quite wrong with the whole system since back in 2008 when I first started looking into things and learned about quantitative easing money printing. And the inf and its effects on inf inflation and the value of our fiat currency, and I just knew it was a bad deal. So that's when I also decided to sell my 401k and put that money into assets and things that can make me money, like in business. And so that's what I've been doing. And it was just a blessing to have Visionary fall into my lap because of the connections that I had previously in business with my real good friend and business partner 
Patrick Moore, who I've been working with for several years, who is also business partners with Andy Morbitz, who is president of Visionary. Um, it, Patrick had had a business relationship with him for the past 10 years. So I'd actually known him previous to Visionary even coming about when they brought this to me. I knew without even having to think for a second thought that it is something that I would need to take part in, absolutely, because it would be quite stupid not to, given the implications that you all are coming to understand at a greater level thanks to the conversation that we've actually just been having now. And I, I'm just incredibly excited after such an incredible event like we've had this past few days, learning of the newest developments that are coming out for Capricorn and CapriPay and our new decentralized exchange of which there is no competition out there at all on the internet because we're basically the first truly BitPeer, which it, which is partnered with Visionary and Capricorn and CapriPay is the first decentral, truly decentralized exchange for cryptocurrency online. So we have so many things, so many stars that are aligning like a constellation of greatness that really you need to get in contact with Adrian or anybody else that you've been speaking with about this. All right, and you need to learn more. You need to take action. Don't think about it anymore because we have limited time until this money system breaks down and everything changes. I know that in coming months, there's going to be a revaluation of currencies and a lot of things are going to change. You need to be positioned. You need to be prepared. And cryptocurrency provides you with the liquidity, the ability to move your money, money that is not controlled or can't be touched by the government because it exists within the blockchain application all right so i urge you to take action with cryptocurrency okay cheers um Taleb. Ginny, you okay my, my partner's still listening in, in there cheers salute still drinking the um, wine <laughs> we and, um, salute we got um chin 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 <laughs> we got aragon's partner and um simon that's looking over the pool there just um yeah, Chilling now. Awesome. We forgot to get the. We should have had the pool in the background of the video, but never mind. It was a, it was right, a light yeah. problem. You Beautiful should, pool here, guys. Yeah. Get some some image for you. Okay. Yeah. Guys. There you go. Something like this is what happens when you hang out with the right people, <laughs> working on a good concept. Because we had a couple of really exciting days the last days, right, Adrian? Yep. Your days. How did you like the time in Benidorm with all the leadership team of, of Visionary? Well, you put me on the spot now, but I, I actually booked, we booked the flight on the day, didn't we? We were planning to come a long time ago, we didn't book, but we actually booked the flight at 9, 9 a.m. last Wednesday morning, and we flew 6 o'clock on the same day, very short notice, booked into the hotel, and um, we're out here with about 150, 150 people from all around the world, and it's great to be sort of brushing shoulders with such... Um, such like-minded people and so many experts within this um, cryptocurrency space, you know. So um, this has just been brilliant the last couple of days. And um, I missed last year. Caleb, you were here last year, weren't you? Oh, of the course. Of course, yep. I was blessed to be able to Caleb do Caleb was here for last year's yeah. event. And um, but obviously I missed last year. I've only been in the business. I've only been in the business um, sort of since January this year. Okay, Caleb's been in about 12 months, is it? 12 months or more? more? Just over a year. Yeah, just over a year, yeah. So... This is fairly new to me. Well, saying I've been in about eight or nine months, but um, like I say, I'm in the property, cryptocurrency, gold and silver, and Capricorn is going to be definitely um, play a big part in my life for the foreseeable future, guys. So um, just get in touch with me, send me a message, and um, perhaps you can be here next year. There's events in Vienna coming up, is it? Right in Vienna? That's the next one. And also in Seattle, Washington. Anybody that's near Seattle, Washington, please uh, get more information from Adrian on how to come to our event where, where we will also be having Gary Connors, our cryptocurrency expert, show up in order to speak on the event, as well as myself and Patrick Moore. And I'm looking forward to uh, meeting any of you that can make it out. Absolutely. Yeah. But okay. uh, we, we can uh, say, uh, uh, I can say something. I'm in Vienna with my, with all the world's team uh, in Vienna at 18th uh, of September, Vienna. Oh, well, oh no, it's, it's, it's good. Yes. We're back, back. We're back we on have, track. We have a big event in Vienna. Everybody who wants to come, you can come to Vienna. Only 10 euro for the event. This is like nothing. Uh, cinema, you have a uh, of course, but we are better than cinema. You can see Leonardo DiCaprio coin. 
and he, uh, yes, uh, Frank the Bank, but uh, Leonardo DiCaprio coin, and we can speak about uh, a lot of uh, stuff and uh, things, and you learn a lot of the system. And at the 25th of September, I'm in Moscow. You can uh, Moscow, yeah. Moscow. You can come to Moscow. You can see the amazing energy of Moscow. A lot of Russian people there. I speak there on the stage. Uh, next time, I'm at the 1st of October in Hamburg. So come. You have a lot of possibility. Are you, come speak, are you speaking in, in are you speaking in German or English? I English speak English? in German, but I have translators yeah. because my English is not perfect. It's enough to speak uh, a little bit, but I say it all the time, it's not perfect. And uh, so I have translators, uh, they will translate in English, they will translate in Russian, and mm. uh, anything, so it's not a problem. Mm. Come there, and you learn a lot of things, you must pay a lot of money for it to learn in your life. Some people don't learn it till they are 70 or 80 years old, mm. they don't learn these things. Because the system show you only what you should know. They learn you in the school things that don't make you rich. They learn you in your school things that you don't need. The most things you only learn to be a person. He get two thousand or three thousand euro in the month. That's enough, mm. and you learn whole life for this. Now you learn here in one day things. You don't learn all your life before. Come to us, learn, and after, after, decide if you have the right people in the right company. Okay, brilliant, Frank. We just switch our back around there. You, you control that, um, Caleb. I'll hold the light. So there you go, guys. Um, we say any more questions? Any more? It's, it's coming to the. Um, we're going to call it a day now. Call it a night, rather. Let's see. Simon Jones says, interesting stuff. See, we're having a great time there in Benjo. You are right, Simon. We've had a complete blast here. Wish you could have been here, buddy. Yeah, uh, cheers for that, Simon. Anyway, thanks for everyone, guys. And um, I got a few more days left in Benjo. When, when are you going home, um, Aragon? Tomorrow in the morning, I oh, fly tomorrow. back to Germany. All right. Because I have only a few days, and I must go to Vienna. All right, okay. Okay, Caleb, anything else to say before we shoot off? Thank you all for jumping in on this conversation on cryptocurrency. I hope you found massive value in it. And like I said before, just don't think too much harder about taking action with cryptocurrency. Start taking action tonight. Okay, and uh, Simon, just um, finish off for you for two couple of seconds. Two couple short. of seconds. I'll, 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 I'll keep hold of it. Just, what are you gonna say? Every journey starts with the first step. So the, the only thing which makes it a loser is if you don't move. Just keep on moving, go forward, and we're gonna enjoy the last couple of hours of our beautiful stay here in Benidorm together with wonderful people. So I wish you a nice time. Go get into the blockchain thing and come to the good side. Okay, Take cheers, care. I will be back. Thanks, bye. Ginny, just one quick, anything to say? Besides, cheers. just cheers, drinking the wine. Cheers, adios. You're just here for the holiday, ain't you? Yes, I am. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> okay. Frank, over to you. Finish yeah. off with you, Frank. Yes, what have you got to um, say? Uh, thank you that you have uh, um, uh, heard uh, a long time to uh, think uh, what I have said. But I can say you something. Don't believe me anything. Don't believe me anything. I said third time. Don't believe me anything. Check what I have said. Google, research, research all. Don't believe me anything. We make research and Google it for yourself. And when you have seen that it was right what I have said. Then you have the serious company here. You have a serious opportunity to change your life. Not the opportunity is the cause. The opportunity is only the effect when you change your thinking. When you want to change your life, you must think, you must change your mindset. You can't think like before. You can't change, change anything when you think like before. So. Make a research, check all, and when you have seen that it is right, that the money system is not good, that the debt system is not good, when you see this cryptocurrency is a real opportunity, check it all, and when you have checked it, come to our company, we give you a great opportunity to get so much support, to get so much professional, they help you to get successful, 
and in six months or after six months you think my god i have changed in a only six months all my life i haven't believed before at this thing mm. okay thank you and uh, i wish you a good night okay thanks everyone cheers carly for holding the camera and um thanks everyone for, for um joining us in this i'll see you all at the bank guys okay see you all at the bank good night Adios.